Hello everyone, this is Serious Trivia, and welcome back to our tutorial showcase of The Wandering Village. Now last time, we encountered poison for the first time, and now we're stepping into the desert biome for the first time as well. We're not past this cold front, which is still bothering us for the next 13 hours, but I expect temperature to go up afterwards, and we can probably plant some corn and cacti. Um, we will have a water problem. We have plenty stored up in our two water tank. Hopefully that's enough. And also, corn's gonna need water, but cacti shouldn't. So we're also just trying to harvest as much of this beet as we can before they decompose. Um, we can also continue here real quick. Um, take, I don't know about the herbs. It's gonna be freezing. No, it's gonna be hot. So maybe this should be canceled as well. We'll see. We'll try to limit water usage. We're gonna need five workers very soon. I guess I can turn this to cactus and then finish that real quick and then start planting it too. The beets are coming in. Good harvest. No poison. Got the stone. Sand dune is new. Let's check it out. I have no idea what we should expect. We can't plant it yet, so we're just gonna stay in harvest beat mode for now. This tree needs to go, so we can put a berry farm, which is gonna be our main food source. Oh, the big beast is going to sleep before he gets to the nice resting spot? I guess he's sleepy. It's fine. It's not a big deal. He was running. Now he's walking. He's going to probably go to sleep soon. Waiting on the plants to grow. He's sitting. And looks like down we go. Alright, this is ready. We're gonna do another berry gatherer here. Both 67%. How do we want to do the roads? I mean, we can't connect it through this main road, which is kind of sad. And I don't want to kill a berry bush just to do... Yeah, I guess we push it out this way as far as we can and... We'll just let the road come to us, or we don't even have to let the road get here. But I kind of like roads, so we'll do it. The builders need to do something. And he's gonna sleep. Alright, cold front, please go away. It's not growing yet. can't plant it yet. Temperature is not there. We got sand. Well, sand is a resource? Can be turned to glass. Alright, that makes sense. Oasis for water. Interesting. We're gonna hit the spot behind us. I don't think the ruined settlements are gonna be people. Temperature, just waiting for that to hit. Oh. 
oh, storage full couriers. They'll be here. We have plenty of workers. This technically could be a housing zone. I mean, technically one side of the house doesn't actually have roads, but you don't really need roads. It's just for looks. They can just live next to the farm. Or we can maybe fit some other building, which makes more sense. We can stick to providing road for everyone. All right, the last beat. Ah, we're in hot temperature time. Let's pump it up. Let's start planting corn. We're in the perfect zone for it. All right, it's gonna exhaust a lot of our water supplies, but I think that's gonna be okay. I think water's not really for drinking, it's just for planting. The people only demand food. So we have three of each worker, and we still have five general workers. Wait, are they not employed? They're not employed yet, but they will be. So those five will go over here. They will show up soon enough. Oh, we locked it. My bad. Fixed. The corn's gonna use water, the cactus, no water, I believe. Hmm. I guess we feed it. I don't think we need wheat yet. We do have the knowledge to pick up stuff. Four villagers, improve productivity, offer decent protection from poison. This is also important. Tree situation's not that urgent. I mean, sure. Let's take care of it with food. We have the mushrooms and the kitchen, so... Only makes sense we get the catapult to shoot it into his mouth. They're, wa they're walking towards their job, and then they'll start planting. So we got our compost actually going. Hmm. I don't know if we want to be close to it. There's advantages, obviously. There's also disadvantages. We can just put it closer to the storage. Ooh, this is actually a pretty good shape to put here. Although, who would like to live next to a compost heap? That's the question. We can fit it here. It will fit perfectly, actually, as the last building on this edge. Alright, let's do that. Keep it away from our residential. And close to the farms, because that's where it's going. They're back. So all the ones kind of behind us are done. Let's take care of a far one first. Want to know what we get in the ruins. And then Oasis is curious, but we'll walk closer in the future. We're going to be out of beets if we keep cooking it up. Hmm. Don't know how I feel about that. But I guess we want to cook it up. Yeah, harvesters need to get queued to do things or else they're just going to be standing there. The last tree on the northern side. Plenty of berry growth. Rocks. This tree's not ready. Trying to not cut the trees in this area. Oh, can't find workers. 
let's take one away from the beet soup and then reduce this by two. This is actually more efficient. Let's run two people over here. I can probably farm these berries. We're not going to berry farm this area. Can someone... Oh, it's not done growing yet. Oh, it's not going to grow anymore. It's frozen. That's okay. We keep it there until we move into a different biome. Big guy is still sleeping. So do we just eat the cactus? It doesn't look like a food. Is this something we can... St it's not something we can store in the pantry. I'm curious what it gives us. Are we just harvesting water from it? An elderly woman. A lot of them want bread. Yeah, we'll leave her be. And we got some bread. And that's not robbing her? Alright, we don't ask questions. Okay. We probably only need one worker here. Yeah, you guys are working too fast. We don't need that many wood. We're going to be able to get compost for fertilizers. We can also get biogas, but that's for, like, decontamination. Oh, a berry did grow here. Now I feel like we don't need this road. This road can be done so much better. Oh, they're back so quickly. Let's work on stuff behind us, because we're about to leave this area. Yeah, we'll just say this road connects to it, and we don't need to do anything fancy there. Come on, we got builders not doing things. Let's move it. Yeah, what are we getting from these? Water. Actually, water. So, corn's our food. Cactus is our water. That's kind of cool. I can dig that. So instead of being a beet soup maker, we can start making some polentas. Let's see if there's anything to harvest. It's not ready yet. I mean, there's things queued up.
and we're moving. But then we immediately hit the rest spot, right? Pretty soon, right after. I guess the water supports the corn. I mean, that's nice. We have our berry source, we have our polenta source. Ooh, small tree growing here. All right, nice and comfy. I don't know if he's gonna rest, because he's not tired. Might just completely ignore this rest area. Yeah, not sure he's going to sleep here, though. Rocks are so hard to come by. Oh, we got the quarry. What are we doing? Hold on. So we're going to clear that out. We don't have to build it here, to be honest, but those land weren't being used anyway, so it's fine. Would this work on both of them? I don't think so. We cleared the land for this. We knew this was going to be a spot. We can start with this. We don't have enough workers to do multiple, I think. I mean, this is enough mushroom. We're not exactly feeding him. I'm actually thinking we get the decontaminator now, in case we run into another poison situation. And about the trebuchet, pull it from the front, right? Yeah, we're trying to launch it into his mouth. Mm. Doesn't fit nicely. We could just put it behind. It actually would cover the top road, which is kind of nice. They actually grow, 60%. Same thing here. Man, that was fast. Actually, Oasis, just curious. Hurry up, I want stone. All right, where do we steal another worker? That's a good question, actually. Berry gatherer? Maybe. I'm thinking we steal a builder first. I mean, there are things to be built, but uh, couriers need to send the supplies over first. Th 
this can come down. He doesn't need to stop. We're about to hit some more workers. We have the houses for it. We have 14 empty rooms. Oasis event. Blackwater's arriving at the site. The oasis, the oasis, unlike anything you've ever seen. The water's black and almost opaque. Still, your scavengers dying of thirst can't wait to take a sip. Ooh. Let's analyze it. Turn out to be harmless. 66 water. Excellent. Better to be careful. I mean, we got plenty of water from the cactus, so I think we're fine. We can give them compost to grow better, I guess. I mean, we are making it. Might as well use it. Right, we're about to bump into people here. We could use some more workers now. We have quarries. And lumber, camp, sawmills, not, are this? Yeah, sawmills, they're not of full capacity. Alright, just three more. Puts us at 49. 50 might be a threshold where, you know, demand goes up again. This is kind of nice. Easily add them in. Berry's fine. This is fine. These are fine as well. I guess we can refill the builder. So it's 333. Three. Yeah, we can easily take on six more people if we want to. Got the jobs for them. Oh, right. Done again. Let's see, where we want to go? Let's continue south. He's very, very good at listening to us to right now. And accepting all our recommendations. To be honest, can we do Plenta here and Berry here? It just makes more sense with where people are going with the resources. It doesn't feel like there's any supply clogs. Although, these can be improved. Where are builders? Guess they're working on this. Um, speaking of builders, they're the first one to go. Oh, different types of food. Once we get a worker, we can give him food. We do have food. We, we've been cooking it up for a while now. We have eight of them. Even decorated it. Yeah, I guess now is to take care of him if he needs help. And then probably wheat. A lot of bread related events. 
We did get some bread, but it'd be nice to get a stable source. Anyways, things look pretty good. Scavenger's back, got more sand. We are going down this way, so we'll probably be close to that. We're close to everything. Knowledge is probably the only thing that's really worth. So far, I don't feel like we need another set of scavengers. Like, one is enough. At least that's the feel. I don't think we have that many population surplus to be dumping it into two more scavengers. Maybe after we research the scouting tower, which expands our vision, it might be worth more to invest in a few more scouts. But right now, really no reason to do so. Eh, 1% poison, he's fine. Our water supply is perfectly fine. There's buckets on the ground, literally. Yeah, the compost might be overdoing it. We don't have enough and it's just gonna slow us down. So we're gonna pass on that for now. Let's store up some more and then we invest in it. Oh, decontamination is um, is ready to go. Fresh air. Okay, that's cool. Yeah, we put it right here, I think. Nice 4x4. Four four. They want us to feed it. Let's do it. Wait, why can't we do it? Did no one bring a food over? We have four. There's four. Oh, he needs to be laying down or walking. I think he's about to lay down. Yep. May I? Oh, is he just... he's sleeping. Okay, we'll wait till he wakes up. And first thing we'll do is... trebuchet food directly into his mouth. He'll be like, trust us more. And you'll get more food. Yeah, poison's not a big issue right now. The desert climate's treating us decently well. We can probably do a road cutoff right here. I don't know if we're gonna ever cash out on those berries. I don't think so. I feel like we can probably harvest this. There's more promising berry locations up there and this is just kind of in the way. Even this is starting to look more promising. All right, we got our decontaminator, but I think we can turn it off. We don't have bio, we don't have biogas. Like, there's a lot of things that's needed here. It's kind of like the hospital. We need it when we need it. But right now we don't need it. And plus, this thing... Feels like we might need two of these. 
One to do compost, one to do biogas. Well, think about it. We would need additional worker, which we don't really have. And we don't really need that right now, so not super important. Gavenger's back. Uh, about to leave this area. Oh, nice. Another group coming back later. I mean, he's going to be walking, right? Yep, let's shoot him with food. Wait, is there animation or... Did we shoot him with food? Yes, we did. Oh, there's no animation. Okay. He just basically got the food. No, it's preparing. Is someone going to fire it? Hold on, scavenger. I want to see if he fires it. That was fast, by the way. Crank it up. Crank it up. Preparing? How hard is this preparing? I mean, the guy is starving. Oh, here comes the staff, maybe? Oh yeah, let's go, 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 go. Please launch it. Ah, uh, no. There's no animation. We did feed it. That's a slight miss. But maybe they'll add that animation in the future. Question if we want more sand. I mean, our water is doing fine. We don't need to do oases, but there might be cool events. Last one felt a bit poisonous. Gotta give our harvesters some things to do. I mean, there's also these berries. Yeah, we're going to need that if we are going to do the decomp uh, decontaminator. The other question is... Requires a lot of water. Doesn't make sense. Flour into making bread, basically. We will need this whole line for bread. Faster road, but requires stone. Not sure if the speed bonus is going to be worth it. We can also pet him. I think we get the bile first. We are working our way through the decontaminator. Might as well have all the raw material first. Oh, if only a fit here. It's a little long. There is also no rotation, I think. At least not any buttons I have discovered. I mean, this technically can be anywhere. Where would we want this to be? It's a very long building. It's a 4x7. Hmm. I mean, fits nicely in between his horns. We just gotta clean out this berry. It'd be on the main road, technically. This is still farming area. Twenty-two 
21. That's faster. Maybe there's some other cool event. I don't think we need that much sand. But actually, now that I think about it, once we leave the desert, we're not going to have an easy way to get sand. We still have enough houses, we don't have to start a new residential area. Oh, that berry got cleaned out fast. I mean, we did ask them to hurry, but... Still faster than I expected. Maybe another compost here, just to get the other resource that we need. We would have workforce coming. I guess it's full. Missing resource? I mean, we don't need the other two. We can shoot it again. Let's do it. Alright, we got incoming. Only two. We're above 50, which we hit another tier. Food quality requires four. Okay. Variety is still good. Housing desire ideally is tier three. Okay. So we only got two worker. I guess one person... No, actually, that's going to be shut down once we build it. We'll have one person work the compost for biogas. And then once we get the bio extractor, we'll have the other work on that. Right now, we'll maintain the 333. Ooh, hot spot. Heat wave. Hmm, interesting. Guess we keep collecting the sand. Oh, the party's not back? I didn't see a... Oh, the flag is up there. Maybe I was just a little blind. We're probably not going to touch the housing until we know how big the next tier of the housing is. Alright, we got more sand. And we're going to get more sand. Now the hot temperature is not going to bother the cactus. It's going to slow down the corn, which is not a big deal. Yeah, we'll be fine. That doesn't seem super harmful. Maybe kill the herbs? Yeah, it kills the herbs. Kills the mushrooms. Small loss. Yeah, the sand is quick. Now we get some more stone. Alright, so this one's going to be biogas. We'll do one worker. And then we're going to need the bio. And then we can start getting decontaminator up and running. We would need more people. People ate the bread. I mean, it's fine. It's food. We need to do that whole line of wheat interaction to get bread of our own. Looks like we can fit a 4x4 four four here, or 4x3. We'll see what we need in the future. I mean, knowledge is always good, but maybe I'm convinced sand is now or never. Oh, 
Oh, efficiency went up. There's more berries nearby. This one's almost up. Yeah, there's nothing for our builders to do. And that's okay. I mean, he has 1% inside. Oh, oh, inside the Obu. I was like, are we going inside the Ombu? Um, we're going to just close it for now. It looks like a hot air balloon, so I'm guessing the whole hospital floats. Like in the back, it looks like what? Oh, that's a weird. What are? What is that? It's just art? It looks like they're just drawing it. And this is just like a little statue. That's where like the meds coming in. And then this whole thing floats and probably like goes to him and feeds him medicine. And this little guy's like, I have the best job in the world. I'm in charge of the catapult, the trebuchet that launches food into our big guy. All right, we're in this heat wave. There's no point to walk fast because this is set times 24 hours every time we just the second we hit it is 24 hours. So there's no point telling to run. There are people there. Biome wise. Can we ask them to go north? He accepts. Awesome. Warehouse or sleep. Mm, or neither. I think we need the better houses. We're going for cottage. We need glass. Right. If we need glass. We need this. We have all the basic stuff. We have bio. We can feed it. I don't know if it's super important until I to sleep now. I mean, maybe it's important. We don't eat this. Not yet. Medicine. Interesting. Yeah, let's get all the basic resources all fixed. Wait, why can I... Ah, oh, there we go. Only in the back? Only in the center. Oh, where his gallbladder is. Well, that is tricky to know. Like, what if we had built stuff here? That would have been a disaster. Hmm. This is fine. Our road runs through here. Perfect. I don't know. I, I guess we would need a worker there. Hopefully only one. Looks like a small building. We only need one for all the done, so I'm guessing we only need one for all the bile. Alright, we're gonna be leaving this. We're going that way. We need knowledge for more research. I mean, this person has a cool job too. Ready to blow the horn to influence the great beast. Yeah, the plants are dying. Walting away. I mean, when this falls, I think we actually chop this one first. This feels like a build zone in the future.
no worker needed. So there is this heartbeat, right? I guess this is like his health as well. And with each beat, we're going to get some bile. And that's pretty cool. We don't need to put a worker there. I, I probably should put a worker here just to get it open. So that they can start storing it. Wait, that doesn't look hot. That looks like poisonous. Which is why we went north. Not that we saw that, but that turned out great, actually. This feels like maybe hotter than this desert. I don't know. This, it feels like slightly different biome, but it's clearly still desert. We'll figure it out. All right, temperature's back to normal. We're doing fine. Not enough mushrooms. Yeah, mushroom all died, which is why there's not enough mushrooms. We, we can plant more. Yeah, we don't need that many harvesters anymore. Because it's just occasional stone or mushroom, maybe tree sometimes. And it's really never a rush now. Is that a berry? I cleaned out all the berries, it still grows. Guess you don't need another one to start germinating, just designated areas. Yeah, we've been out of beat. The place is on effect this place is on affected by poison looks oh, are we at Well, we don't have the research for sleep, but he might sleep. It's he says 63. Maybe he rests. Looks like it. We're about to nap. Nice. And we're getting a lot of good stuff. Since we're sleeping here, do we take this? I mean, it's just sand. Let's do something more exciting like a ruined settlement. Wow, light it's moving across. Oh, that's a new weather condition. Your most fragile buildings. So sort of like a rebuild effort, potentially. I mean, let's do this first. We're going to walk closer to that anyways. Hmm, new weather pattern. I mean, desert life so far, it's pretty good. It's just cactus and corn. Definitely good meals. I think we can queue this now. It's gonna be ready by the time someone walks there. Gotta give our harvesters something to do. Ambu sleeps. Alright, got some water. Yeah, we have to do furnace and then glass blower before we can do cottage because it looks like we need iron and glass and stone slabs, planks. That's going to be a total of four knowledge. We only have three so far, so we can't do much even after we get those tech. But hopefully we get knowledge before then. Wait, that's this guy is the decontaminator. The flamethrower using the bile to burn down any toxin plant. Yeah, it's nice. We'll beef up the group when we need to if we walk through some toxin. Like, what building is going to be like the damaged buildings? No idea. Fragile buildings? 
This is technically kind of fragile. Mm, yeah, it's not delay. Oh, this thing swept through. I was, we might miss it. So speeding it up, slowing down? Maybe. What's wrong here? Ah, uh, we had overstocked. Okay, no problem. I mean, no one's getting sick, so like this is really just in the background. And of course, this is a novice difficulty tutorial playthrough. I'm assuming things will be much more randomized and difficult if it was on veteran. We'll kind of gauge that. Let's get our people first, and then we'll figure out what speed we need to be at to get rid of that thing. And how is this climate different? What? I mean, so far it looks good all around. We're about to step into it. I, I don't see any change. If anything, it just looks like more mountainous desert. Guess that's what it is. All right, we're fine. All right, we entered the desert biome from the desert biome. I'm ready to pick up some new people. Builders without jobs. I'll launch it. Gotta increase that trust. Did he just give an eating animation? I think so. Wait, our health? got three more um we'll figure out a way to deal with them we picked up 18 bread from the ruined settlement maybe we need to send our doctors out that one percent poison might be actually hurting our beast turn it on we got people we have herbs we got three new people so that's gonna be fine one extra worker hmm where are we going with that one extra worker? Maybe cook a little faster food for our big guy? We might need more herbs now because we're treating him, but there's so much stockpile, we're fine. Yeah, let's cook a little faster. We got more mushrooms coming in as well. Alrighty, we should be able to heal him up. Alrighty, so I think this is a good place to stop. We'll see. This definitely is a poison biome. Just doesn't look right. We're going to see if we can dodge that hurricane or tornado. Desert storm. Desert storm. Uh, next time. See if we can juke it. Uh, but things looking pretty good. Our village is coming around. We're going to try to upgrade the houses. Get the glass blowers, iron furnace out. Um, always need more people. And uh, we'll be... Continuing this journey next time. So until then, bye.